At least 500 Holocaust survivors are buried in Cincinnati cemeteries, and tonight a local group is working on a new way to honor them. WCPO 9 News reporter Keith Berry Golick visited a Jewish cemetery on the city's west side to see how they are being remembered. Have a great trip. Sandy Kaltman Bye. drives to see her parents. She doesn't visit often because she likes to think that they're always with her. Turn right onto Anderson. My parents' story has shaped my world. But it's one that begins with tragedy. Instead of going to high school, my mother became a slave laborer for the Nazis in the ghetto. Forced from their homes, Roma and Sam Kaltman met in a Polish ghetto. They bonded over a love of books. This was a gift from my father to my mother. The book-shaped necklace was also a promise because when they were separated and sent to Auschwitz, Roma and Sam pledged that they would try to find each other. And they did eventually marrying and moving to Cincinnati, where they're buried today. This Sunday is Yom HaShoah, Holocaust Remembrance Day, and members of Jewish cemeteries of greater Cincinnati want to do something special. There was nothing like this in the world. To honor people like Roma and Sam. You think about your family, your survivor family. You think about those who perished. It's part and parcel of, of, of who you are. Ray Warren says the project started four years ago. His colleague designed a marker with barbed wire, the Star of David, and the word remember. The markers are now available to families of Holocaust survivors in Cincinnati. These are difficult times for Jewish people around the world. According to the Anti-Defamation League, anti-Semitic incidents have jumped almost 400 percent since the start of the Israel-Hamas war. Sandy says preserving stories like her parents can help. That's part of my faith. It's also part of the legacy that I see growing up in a family of Holocaust survivors. Sandy prays as a way to remember. She prays for others to remember, too. If my parents were here today, I think that's what they would say. Don't forget and learn. Learn from what happened and strive to make the world a better place. In Green Township, Keith Birigolik, WCPO 9 News. These markers are free to families of Holocaust survivors. If you or someone you know would like one, contact the Jewish Cemeteries of Greater Cincinnati. You can find their information on WCPO.com.